the tournament to crown the new GFW Next Gen Champion. Ollie the Fortune Fighter, Josh from Devon's Ghost, Tyler Breeze, Buddy Murphy, Jack Corrupted Jack Gallagher, Oni Lorcan, Humberto Carrillo, and Demon Finn Balor. All dying to meet Braxton Sutter for a shot at the Next Gen Championship. And away we go. And guys, if you're in the chat comments, let me know what you think of this video. Drop a comment in the in the live chat. Comment in below. Like and share this video. DDT that like button. And enjoy the matches. As brought to you by Nathan Hen Nathan Wallace himself. Ollie the Fortune Fighter. successful run in the Overlord's contest and was a fan favorite among the citizens there. And it looks like he wants to continue that success here in WWE. Let's see what he can do. And let's see what I can do in the next gen tournament in the Brooklyn Von Braun Gymnasium. Ollie the Fortune like Fighter. Bring all the experience of his fortune fighting days to this match tonight. I can't wait to see what he does. He wants to win this tournament. He wants to be inducted in as the CAW, just like just like Braxton Sutter and Chad Gable has. He wants to go to June 4th to get a shot at the title. And his opponent, representing the Varsity Club from Rio Linda, California, weighing in at 220 pounds, Josh the Lady. If this one representing the Devin's fire, ghost Josh along with Symphony took no care of the bloody boy in 2005 and now will he take care of Ollie the all fortune WWE. fire and advance forward in this next gen championship tournament Here we go Unstoppable dedication is doing what is right has made Ali an instant favorite for the WWE Universe. Ali hopes to bring everyone together to chase the light. Providence is fired up for this one, guys, and rightfully so. This match is going to be amazing. Ali the Fortune Fighter using his quickness to demilitarize Josh from Devin's Ghost. Elbow coming from 205 live to the main roster. Ali has found himself in some real David and Goliath matchups. How has he been able to turn those situations to his advantage? I'd say it's more like Jack and the Beanstalk, actually. Jack and the Beanstalk. Think about it. Ali climbs the turnbuckles like a beanstalk and then it comes falling through the sky with the old 5 4. Oh man. High fly flow by Ollie the Fortune Fighter. Will he advance? Cover one, two, no. Hey, I guess you never know. Great. Oh, right hand by Josh. And another one. Trying to hold him. What a slam! My Ollie the Fortune Fighter. Ollie the Fortune Fighter. Where that one turning point to end this will come from. 
And now! He's not going to like this. Josh won't like this! Once more, setting it up! Kick Double super kick! A super kick party for Josh and Devin's ghost! Could this be it? It is! Only the Fortune Fighter wins this first round tournament match! The heart of 205 Live on display right here. He is now 1-0 in Nate's Global Force Wrestling. Ollie the Fortune Fighter continues on in the next-gen title tournament, hoping for bigger things down the line. Tyler Breeze against Buddy Murphy. The winner of this match will meet Ollie the Fortune Fighter in the first round. In the second round of the tournament, sorry. The Brooklyn Von Braun High School Gymnasium. Brooklyn Von Braun Gymnasium. Here we go. Tyler Breeze is about to sparkle. He has his marching orders for the Monday Night Messiah, oh, Seth Rollins, oh, man. to take out Tyler Breeze and see, and to advance against the Fortune Fire Ollie. Now he wants to add insult to injury. Back now inside the ring. We're underway, and the king of Cuteville is on the move, trying to make sure his kingdom remains intact. And across the way is Buddy Murphy, an explosive superstar with a perpetual chip on his shoulder. It seems that no matter what he does, Murphy still considers himself the, quote, best-kept secret of WWE. And he channels that frustration into no, every they gotta get that belt out of there. in the ring. Say what you will about the tactics of Buddy Murphy. When he steps between the ropes, he puts oh, everything on the Buddy line. Buddy Murphy that just got himself disqualified. Agree to disagree on Using that, that old NXT moniker. title. You're absolutely right about Murphy giving it his all in the ring, Corey. Tyler Breeze did it. Tyler Breeze got a hit. Oh, man. I think that's a fatal mistake on Murphy's part. This is not going to make the... Monday Night Messiah happy. So the Monday Night Messiah loses his only next gen representation as Tyler Breeze advances on in the next gen title tournament. And one who has been on the rise in the next gen division, corrupted Jack Gallagher, as he goes up against Oni Lorcan from Boston, Massachusetts. Eddie Edwards' is hometown. Now, will corrupted Jack Gallagher continue his rise 
in his quest for the next-gen title? Or will Oni Lorcan pull off the upset? We're about to find out. Brooklyn Von Braun Gymnasium? Is that? Yes, I, I think it is. It's Gentleman Jack. The following contest is a King of the Ring first round match. Making his way to the ring from Manchester, England. Weighing in at 167 pounds. He's a welterweight. Jack Gallagher. Corrupted Jack Gallagher. What's wrong with him? No one is quite sure, Byron, but whatever it is, there's no denying that Jack has benefited from his newfound power. I'm glad I'm not in the ring with him. Well, the only one that can second in a ring with him is Oni Lorcan. As the pictures of Brooklyn Von Braun in the background. What he's doing in there. What? He'll be fine. He looks as ready as ever for the match tonight. Uh, it's not him I'm worried about. It's everyone else. Oh, man. Corrupted Jack Gallagher is not interested in the photos of Brooklyn Von Braun. He just wants to advance brawler. and oh, rise oh, higher yeah. in the next-gen division. Not if only Lorcan can do anything about it. This guy is embarrassing to watch on social media, but he is fun to watch in the ring. Corrupted Jack Gallagher, Oni Lorcan in the Brooklyn Von Braun Gymnasium. Here we go in the third match of the 20. 2K20 quarterfinal match. That means Gallagher can fly or tie into knots and handle his pints. If you haven't hit record yet, now might be a good time to do that. These guys are going to have a Now remember, the two losing semifinalists will face in a third place consolation match to determine who will face Ch Chad Gable for the TNA World Junior Heavyweight X Division Championship on the June 4th Mega Show. Whoa, DDT! Drop kick! Great athleticism. Splendid attack from the gentleman. That's what he does. Keep on the attack. Oh no, he's about to break his arm. Corrupted Jack. Will he? Oh, well, yes. Impact. Right, right on impact, right on the arm. Just what he did to Apollo Crews last week. This is a big risk. Will it pay off? Look at this. Beautiful oh man! Up. He's getting a little batter now. No need to panic. He's still swinging. Corrupted Jack Gallagher, swinging just like he did, picking up right where he left off in the inaugural episode of Nate's Global Force Wrestling Amp last week, firing on all cylinders. He is one and zero. How impressive was that reversal? Now the only question is, will he improve? Harsh oh impact. man! Oh man! Cover up! One! Up. No! Almost an advancement for Corrupted Jack! Elbow drop. Oh! Trying for a Solidian headbutt! Only Lorcan blocked it! Is it possible? Can we see an upset in the making? And oh says, my, not, not in... That's every intention of denying Lorcan. And an upset. Hammerlock. Oh, oh no, oh. Penta Breaker! Penta Breaker! He's starting to struggle here. Yeah, he needs to make an adjustment here. Oh no, another pinna breaker perhaps? I think He's it is! It is! There's the pin. Can his opponent kick out? Only Lorcan gets oh, the man. too soon. Only Lorcan looking on his game right now. Shoving him away. 
DDT. Smith. Oh, Salivian headbutt! Salivian headbutt! Fine! Corrupted Jack Gallagher! Nice suplex! Keep your He's about to go to the top! Way. He's going to the top! All the way from the top rope! Look at the height! One! Two! Oh, no! How'd he do that? He comes up short here. He looks off his game right now, Michael. Merciless torment. Oh, finger splash! Together some big moves Not his here. corner drop kick, though. Oh, right up there. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. competitors is showing through tonight the adrenaline is coursing through their veins boy you're a pin uppercut oh, and another uppercut. european uppercut Looking come up with jack gallagher plenty of fight left gallagher kicks out a loss there would have been anything but gentlemanly but the front face lock applied. Nice suplex. Tony Logan looking on his game right now. Wasn't expecting that. Wow. Salivian headphone you again. Not looking good, guys. Boom! What a drop kick by Gentleman Jack. He's got him covered. Corner drop kick. Two! He got him! Corrupted Jack Gallagher advances in the next gen title tournament. A lot of good action in that one. Here's oh, man! Look. Now corrupted Jack Gallagher is 2-0 in Nate's Global Force Wrestling. And in so doing, advances to the second round of the Next Gen Title Tournament. Chase Bridges will get a shot. The shoulders are down for three, and this one's Chad Gable. I've been informed we'll get a shot at the GFW X Division title whilst Chase Bridges will get a shot at the TNA World to like Junior Heavyweight X Division title. So, always one step ahead. Humberto Carrillo against the demon Finn Balor. Who will advance against corrupted Jack Gallagher? Who we're gonna find out. Demon Finn Balor is 1-0 in Nate's Global Force Wrestling. Humberto Carrillo making his debut in Nate's GFW. Right here at the Brooklyn Von Braun Gymnasium. Alberto Carrillo is here. The following contest is a King of the Ring first round match. Making his way to the ring from Monterrey, Mexico. Weighing in at 198 pounds. Humberto Carrillo! 
Humberto Carrillo, the two-time former number one contender for the United States heavyweight title, now in this next-gen title tournament to prove his worth. This guy is totally optimized for in-ring competition. Agreed. And guess Corey, who's coming to Brooklyn Von Braun Gymnasium? And guess who's coming to... Guess who's coming to spook the entire Brooklyn Von Braun Gymnasium? Oh my... It's the demon, Finn Balor! Coming here... Coming into this GFW title tournament for one purpose. To win. He needs only three wins to get in. Woo! Brooklyn Von Braun Gymnasium, it's on his feet for the Demon. And his opponent from Gray County, Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, the Intercontinental Champion, Finn Balor! Recognized by WWE 2K20 as the Intercontinental Champion, the Demon, Finn Balor. SummerSlam 2016. The, the next day due to injury, but Finn Balor continues to grow his legend here in WWE. This is our last 2K20 quarterfinal match of the next gen title tournament. Humberto Carrillo, the Demon Finn Balor. Here we go. And here we go. Is a unique experience Slim Blade to start things Finn off. Is an extraordinary superstar, but there's just something about his transformation into the demon that takes him to another level. Guys, Bowling Green better be ready because this match will be like no other. Vertical super oh, Bowling Bam. Green, Indiana is where oh, Corey, the Brawling City, so many obstacles Bowling City Dana Wrestling, what do you think will be not key to Border City tonight? Wrestling. Well, when Finn Balor's overtaken by the... Whoa! Look at the Finn Demon! Balor. He's absorbed some damage already. If he can hold the line here, he'll be in a good position. Nice monkey flip. The demon is and Finn Balor, yeah, the Demon, Finn along with the Demon King and the show. regular Extraordinary... Finn Balor proved their worth last week in that six-man tag team match against three against the Eater of Worlds opponent. Bray Wyatt, the Swamp Father Bray Wyatt, and the Fiend Bray Wyatt in the inaugural episode in the 2K20 uh, edition of the inaugural episode of Nate's Global Force Wrestling. Unless of course he's competing as the Demon, then it's a whole other story. Oh, Reverse Bloody Sunday! Reverse Bloody Sunday! Really? Off the there it is! There it is! Can he put this one, away? two, this he got in! Finn Balor has advanced in the next-gen title tournament! Here we see how the demon propelled Finn Balor to victory. Will he be the one to hand corrupted Jack Gallagher his first loss in Nate's Global Force Wrestling? Will he 
Will he advance to the finals? And be one victory away from getting a shot at the next gen title. I hope you enjoyed it as much as this live crowd appears to have enjoyed it. Oh my, what a first round conclusion. The demon, Finn Balor, getting a victory quickly over Humberto Carrillo. And now we go to the second round, the quarterfinals. Two more quarterfinal matches remaining. Two more quarterfinals down, two to go. The Fortune Fighter. And we have a baseball stadium all lined up. I'll lead the Fortune Fighter and Tyler Breeze for the right. The winner will go to the finals. The winner will go to the GFW Next Gen Championship qualifying match, while the loser will go to the third place consolation match, where the winner will get a shot at the GFW X Division title or the TNA World Junior Heavyweight X Division title. The Fortune it's Fighter has done pretty well here. Contest. It was a fan favorite among the citizens there. And it looks like he wants to continue that success here in WWE. Let's see what he can do. Looks like he's ready to bring all the experience of his fortune fighting days to this match tonight. I can't wait to see what he does. Oh man, the crowd in Memphis is pumped for this one. And I can hardly wait. Things just got a lot more. It's Tyler Breeze who advanced with a victory over Buddy Murphy by disqualification. Ali Here we go, Ali Fortune Fighter. Never set foot in the WWE ring. He never backs down and never gives up on himself or the people of the WWE universe. You know, I saw Tyler Breeze earlier on today, and he gave me a citation for my suit. I didn't really appreciate that. Well, he gave you a citation for your suit and absolutely throwing you in jail for your pajamas. Mm. If you're Remember the, the third place consolation match? You to shut down his insane speed. Hit him well, until he's held in the Winterfest well, Arena, so... Ali's a resilient competitor, but there's only so much damage he can take. To that point, Ali wants to springboard off ropes and convert speed into power. If you force him into a brawl or take him to the mat, look at this! Frog splash! Ah, look at this! Oh, um, arm tiger. twister! Belly to back suplex. No! Kick to the spine. Tyler Brady. Belly to back kick to the spine! To the he won't quit, but it might be better And if he now, yeah, is he wants Tyler Breeze up. Moment. Going for it again. Super kick party. Super kick, right super on kick. Tyler There's Breeze. Could this be it? Is he going to go to the finals? One, two, and he got him. Oh, my God. Ali has done it. Man, what a match and what a oh win. Oh, my goodness. The heart of 205 Live on display right here. Only the Fortune Fighter has advanced to the next gen title qualifier where the winner meets Braxton Sutter in the in fire, not only Fire Pro Wrestling World but the here June 4th winner, Mega Show. Fortune Fighter! They proved who the better competitor was tonight. 
If Breeze keeps this up, he'll move from citing WWE superstars to becoming a parking meter maid. It'll be interesting to see the fallout following this big sink. And now... We are in our last semi-final match. The winner advances. Corrupted Jack Gallagher. And the demon, Finn Balor. The Irish captor, Finn Balor, is looking to take all enemies hostage as we get underway here. He's wrestled in pinstripes and in a full suit, but don't let Jack Gallagher's outfits mask the fact that he's got an array. He won't take the demon hostage. I am the first to admit that Gallagher has a unique look and demeanor, but the gentleman is always one move away from picking up a victory. Damage retention is applying in this tournament, but the coming into this match. The demon seems to appear to have no damage whatsoever from his last previous belt with Humberto Carrillo. Oh, that might be it. Oh no! Whoa! Sling blade find the demon! This is gonna be big. From the top! I'll be honest, I truly don't fully understand the demon, and I don't think anyone but Finn Balor actually does. But I do know it'll take a lot to take him out Wind. of the The demon's one of the most mysterious existences in all of WWE, and while his opponent probably prepared to fight Finn Balor, this isn't exactly the same thing. The best bet is to bring the fight to the demon. Just know it won't. All the way for the top! Diving body splash. Coffin! Front coffin smash! Wow! Looks like Gallagher is feeling the physicality of this contest. How can he not? The corrupted not Jack sure Gallagher is feeling the wrath now of the demon. Jack Gallagher to stop being a gentleman and start his comeback. Textbook vertical suplex. Bam. Oh! Oh! What a kick by the corrupted Jack! What a counter by the, the demon! From oh! Counter by the corrupted Jack! Oh, oh no! Oh no! You oh no! He's not done just yet, Michael. You're not gonna beat the demon that way. And uh, another sling. I thought he was going for another sling blade, but no, a tornado DT instead. Look at Finn Balor here. Ooh, head twist though. Wants to add the head of corrupted Jack Gallagher to his collection of heads already collected in the demon's trophy case. Ready for takeoff. Run, Kelp and smash. Oh my goodness! He's gonna go for it! And Reverse! Bloody Sunday! Reverse Bloody Sunday! The demon is truly taking over now. Just producing it. And now! Coup de Gras! Coup de Gras stop! Cover! One! Two! What an upset! What an upset! That means Tyler Breeze and Corrupted Jack Gallagher will face Finn each other in the third place victory. consolation match while Ollie the Fortune Fighter and the Demon Finn Balor will 
in, are in the finals to determine who will meet Braxton Sutter for that GFW Next Gen title on on the June 4th Here Mega Show. Oh no! Fred Metal Oh no! Fred Metal League trying to the party! You're not going to beat the Demon. Demon can take on anybody. Anytime, any place. And when he gets mad, you know business will pick up. Ooh! As Grand Man Link is about to find out firsthand! Reverse! Bloody Sunday! By the Demon! On Grand Man Link! But that's not going but Metal League's interference won't prevent Finn Balor from reaching the finals with Ollie the Fortune Fighter. This is the match we have all been waiting for. And this is the bout that we have all been waiting for. The match to see who will face Finn Balor for the GFW Next Gen Championship on the June 4th Mega Show in the Zevo Super Mall. Well, it's in the third place consolation match, Tyler Breeze and Corrupted Jack Gallagher, where the winner will go for the GFW X Division title, while the loser We'll go for the TNA World Junior Heavyweight Exhibition title. Here we go. The finals is on. successful run in the over Braxton Sutton Braxton Sutter 2017 from WWE 2K18 is watching this match WWE. even as we speak as with all others in the WWE 2K18 camp watching this 2K20 edition of the tournament as the finals are about to unfold to see who will meet Braxton Sutter is it a fortune fighter or is it a demon we will find out. Club Southpaw, you're about to meet the demon, Finn Balor. And Brexton Sutter from WWE 2K18 has strutted down to, has strutted down has struck down to Club Southpaw to watch this match to see who will meet him in the June 4th Mega Show on Fire Pro Wrestling World. Here he comes, the Demon. The Demon is here. Looking very impressive thus far. Three wins, no losses. Finn Balor has unlocked the crypts of the underworld in his mind and unleashed the demon. Here we go. Club Southpaw, are you ready for the finals? The 2K20 version of the next gen finals. Incredible to determine who will get a shot at the GFW Next Gen Championship, and here we go. For the WWE Ali hopes to bring who will meet together. Braxton Sutter Chase in the finals of the tournament to determine the ring, he's faced with the and Demon. the new GFW Next Gen Champion? Oh my goodness! Front coffin smash by the Demon! Just like he had with Humberto Carrillo. Just like he had with corrupted Jack Gallagher. Now he's taking it to Ollie the Fortune Fighter. It's nothing he hasn't been through before. 
Whoa. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. Strong kick. If you're on the other side of the ring from Ali, what do you do to shut down his insane Whoa. speed? Whoa! Hit him until he can't walk, let alone run. Ali's a resilient competitor, but there's only so much damage he can take. To that point, Ali wants to springboard off ropes and convert speed into power. Wow! If him into a brawl or take him to the mat, he's at a disadvantage. The Demon King is the warrior spirit that lives and breathes inside the body of Finn Balor. There's a point that Finn reaches where he can no longer take a chance against an adversary. And when that time comes, Balor channels the Demon King spirit. Swing way by awesome the Demon! World. Really? Oh, uh, look out! Another Don't front cup and smash! Flash. Away from the ring, Finn Balor conceals the spirit of the Demon King. It's not something Finn wants people to see unless they have to. The Demon King is not something that Finn wants to use unless he has to. Yes, Finn might keep and the now. Demon King hidden away somewhere deep in his soul, but... Oh no, no he drops. wants to put this way away right now! And there it is! The coup de grace stop! Is he going to do for cover one, two, and yes! The demon is going, has punched his ticket. He is going to June 4th. He is going to meet Braxton Here's Sutter the for the vacant Global Force Wrestling Next Gen Championship. What a performance by the demon. In these last two weeks, he won a six-man tag match, and now he won a tournament to earn the right to go to June 4th. Go to, to go to the June 4th Mega Show and to get a shot at Braxton Sutter for the vacant GFW Next Gen title. And I predict that the Demon will be the new Next Gen champ. And after this, We have still the main event to come, and that is the third place consolation match. What a gladiator this demon is. And he's going into that next gen title match with Brex and Sutter with more confidence than ever. And now we're going to the main event. We have reached Our last match of the evening. We have a Japanese referee on standby in the Winterfest. Tyler Breeze. Fandango. And then the corrupted Jack Gallagher. As we talked about in the third place consolation match. The winner is going. The winner is going to the June 4th Mega Show for a shot at the GFW X Division title. The loser will get a shot at the TNA World Junior Heavyweight X Division Championship. So it's an all or nothing third place consolation match to conclude this night. And next week we will present women's action. We will present the women's titles, women's title the tournament. The Fashion Police. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by Fondango, representing Brizongo from seasonal residences. Weighing in at 212 pounds, the NXT Champion, Tyler Breeze. They're Fondangoing. 
Here we go. Corrupted Jack Gallagher. Tyler Breeze, last time he was in this arena, yes. he was beaten uh, by it Trey. It's Gentleman Jack. And his opponent from Manchester, England. Weighing in at 167. No, it, the, Tyler Breeze was injured to allow Lucas Riley to take his place. And Lucas Riley beat Trey, What's so. No one is quite sure, Byron, but whatever it is, there's no Tyler Breeze is in a must-win situation in this arena. As we get ready for our final matchup. Tyler Breeze, Corrupted Jack Gallagher. One half of the popular tag team, Breezango. Tyler Breeze makes it a mission to solve all the cases from his Winner goes files. to get a Dish shot at the GFW Next Gen Championship. Winner goes to the Winner goes to the June 4th Mega Show to get a shot at the GFW X Division title, while the loser will get a shot at the TNA World Junior Heavyweight X Division title. So, a win-win for this for everybody involved in this third place consolation match in this main event. Oh, what a kick by! Corrupted Jack Gallagher. And Remember, they're playing for King. The One of them will he's get a shot at either title. Yeah, but he's not a win will get yet. them a shot at the GFW X Division title. Stop and a loss will well, reduce them to the hamstring. TNA World Junior Heavyweight X Division title. Very nice. What are we gonna see here? Hung up on the second rope. Planet Whammed. Papers. Tyler Breeze is modeled all over the world and continues to be his own biggest fan. But when it comes to competing in the ring, Breeze knows how to win and knows how to inflict serious harm on his opponents. Oh Impressive my goodness, Russian Lake Sweep by Tyler Breeze. To let up now. Oh, smash. corrupted Jack Gellher! Intercepts super and a super kick! Tyler Breeze is measuring. Could this be it? Could this be the beauty shot? As infatuated as Tyler Time to flip it. On prettier! On prettier! Willie Hand, Jack Keller, corrupted Jack Keller, a second defeat, cover one, two, he got him! Tyler Breeze is getting a shot at the GFWX division title while corrupted Jack Gallagher gets a shot at the TNA World Junior Heavyweight X Division Championship. What a phenomenal victory in the Winterfest Arena by... Tyler Breeze to conclude our night. Strategy fell into place with that victory. Another night. Oh my goodness, what a night. Remember, next week we present the women's title tournament. Wow. Just wow. I'm speechless. And while the winners face the winners of Eden winner while the 2K8 and the same as this week. 2K18 winners. 2K18 winner faces off against the 2K20 winner. Er, in the third place consolation match, but this time, the winner goes on to... This time, next week, the, in the third place consolation matches of the women's tournament, the winner is of... Um, the winners of the third place consolation match will get a shot at the TNA Knockouts title. And so, drop, and comment, drop a comment below... Drop a comment below... Like and share this video. Oh, DDT that like button if you can. On behalf of Weekly Wallace, Names Coliseum Video, Dreamland World Weekly, we want to thank you for being a part of the second episode on Nate's Global Force Wrestling Amp. From all of us, I'm Nathan Wallace. Have a good rep, have a good week, and stay safe and stay alive, everybody. And have a good night, everybody. And I hope you've enjoyed episode number two of Nate's Global Force Wrestling Amped.